Hi, this is Daniel from Stadler Forum and today I talk to you about how to measure the humidity level in a room. We actually do have two devices at Stadler Forum to help you measure this humidity level. One is Selina and one is her little sister Selina Little. Both ladies have the purpose of showing you the humidity level as well as the temperature of your room. Now let me give you some technical background information. They have both implemented the same hygrometer, which actually shows a humidity level between 10 and 98%. They also have a temperature sensor, which ranges from minus 10 to plus 50 degrees Celsius. You will see the Fahrenheit up here. Now let me give you some background information about what the humidity level actually means. Doctors recommend a humidity level between 40 and 60 percent. We at Stadler Forum, we believe that you are perfectly fine with a humidity level between 45 and 50 percent. Now, as you can see on Selena, we are only at 37. This means we are below the recommended humidity level. Of course, there's a solution for this. If the humidity drops below 40 percent, you can use a humidifier to increase the, humid the humidity in your room. If the humidity level is above 60% for a longer period of time, please make sure to use a dehumidifier. Otherwise, you risk of getting mold at your walls. All right, now let me move to the next important point, where to place your hygrometer in your apartment or your house. Please do not put it in a tight shelf where there is no air circulation possible. The sensor back here needs some air circulation, otherwise the humidity reading will be faulty. Next important point is not to expose your hygrometer to direct sunlight. If you expose it to direct sunlight, the temperature will increase and the humidity reading will not be accurate. Now, if you place two hygrometers side by side, there's a certain risk of not having exactly the same measurement. That's not a problem because those hygrometers, they do have a certain tolerance of plus minus 3%. So if they are close to each other, that's fine enough. Now, before I come to a technical explanation about how such a sensor actually works, let me quickly summarize the facts. A hygrometer shows you the humidity level. The humidity level should be above 40 and below 60 percent. If this is not the case, either use a humidifier to increase the humidity level or a dehumidifier to decrease the humidity level. All right, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. If you like to see more videos like this, subscribe to our channel. And if you have questions, write them in the comments below. Now, let me move to the technical explanation about the sensor. You can see this little tiny white sensor. This actually is the humidity sensor. The humidity sensor me measures humidity changes by impedance. And the controller on this electronic board actually takes the humidity change as well as the temperature in consideration and then calculates the humidity level of the room. We use the same hygrometer sensors in Selena Little, in Selena and in most of our humidifiers. So I think that's quite sufficient as technical background information. If you have still some more questions about how hygrometers work and how measure humidity best in your home, just write us in the comments. So give us a thumbs up if you like this video, subscribe to our channel for even more videos. That's it from Stadler Forum. Wish you a good day. Bye bye.